What's up guys, Matco Michaels here. So let's go take a look and see what he's got on the truck today. Toolbox selling son of a gun now. What about that? But we like them on the loose. Oh shit. Uh oh. Really got socks. Bamboo socks. They look like no bamboo to me. Hey, I'm talking about they feel good. Yeah, they do. Fell in bed. Oh boy. I'll say this. I had to put y'all some up just in case. Huh? Looks First good day to me. Truck Monday morning. The guy bought the whole pack of them. Well, how much are they run? $8. So Goodness. I went ahead and put y'all some back. But as you can see, I got another shipment in this morning. So. I'm good. What we got back here? I'm going to get one of each and I'm going to sample them. I got something new back there. Yeah, that's spotted it new quick, didn't it? Mm -hmm. well, that's a good thing. What do you think, Bill? I'm going to get some gray ones. I'm going to get a pack of gray, a pack of black. And one size fit all? Or? Yes. Good, good, good. Yes. I got a bone to pick with you. Uh-oh. Let me turn the camera around here. <laughs> My buddy, you know, the Matco Dealer started at the same time you did? Yeah. He didn't give all his guys a Matco hoodie. My buddy called me and he said, Hey, you like that Matt Cool hoodie? I said, Hey, you got a Matt Cool hoodie? He said, Yeah, you had to get a Matt Cool hoodie. My guy gave everybody a Matt Cool hoodie. Well, let me call Jay and see what he's doing up there. I said, Oh, my. He's I'm going to have to have a talk with Matt Cool Michael. I'm going to have to have a talk with Jay and see what he's doing. Goodness. I wonder if that's one of his promotions or what he was doing on that. I don't know. He bought a creeper and got two hoodies. I was like, Well, I ain't getting no hoodie. Did you get a hoodie, Bill? I, I ain't seen a hoodie. The only hoodies I've seen is he was wearing one one day. I ain't had no hoodie. What about you, Wally? Hoodies. Did you get a hoodie? I hadn't got a hoodie I yet. I no hoodie either. I, I rock it, nigga, Matco hoodie, though. I've been waiting on some normal size boots. Hey, that's free advertisement, ain't it? Yeah. And, uh, hey, Clay, this is what I was talking about. You see how tall jacket you wear, Clay? Yeah. And you have huh? the extensions. What size jackets you wear? Extra large. Extra large. What size jackets that back there, Bill? Large. Probably a medium. I get you extra large. <laughs> it's probably a medium. It's, it, it's a it's a medium marked wrong. It's a, it's marked as a large, but it's still a medium. Yeah, I need a Matco hoodie. When are you gonna get me some boots in? What size did you say? I wear a thirteen. Like all I've heard about is how comfortable Bill's boots was, and man, I love them. Man, you need to get you a pair of these. My wife was looking at them last night, saying, "Your boots are coming apart. Won't be long." I said, "They ain't coming apart yet. Still in real good shape, considering." I don't think they ordered. We should have them next week. Now remember, we're going to Expo, uh, not next week, but the next. So we, we got some, some new stuff. We're gonna see some cool stuff. We like cool stuff. Uh, I like cool stuff. All right, guys, so we told you about the Facebook page. we got an expo coming up. We really want you to, to join. That way you all can see all the cool and lotus, latest stuff right off the bat. So if you'll search Michael Cummings Maco Tools, you'll see that page. It's going to have my two kids in front of a blue cart. Uh, go ahead and like that and follow that page. Uh, if you're on my route, if you'll show me that you've liked it and that you're following the page, I'll give you an extra... 10% off on your first, your second purchase, whatever it is. Um, so if you're in my route, go ahead, like it, follow it, and show me when we come by and get your 10% off. Um, if you're not on my route, go ahead and follow it so you can see the latest and greatest anyway. And that way you can start asking your macro dealer for some of the cool stuff. There you go. Guys, I'll put a link right down here. That way you guys can see it. Thank Save that 10% off. So what decide. we got back here, we got to talk about this. That's a uh, that's pretty sharp set right there. It is. It's double sided. Double sided on each end, or double sided on each end. Double sided, so one on each end. Sticks in there, extra long. So good reach. Mm -hmm. Just got that in last night. 
guess I'm gonna have to see it. Yeah, 22 piece. I thought that's what it was, but I wanted to make sure. If it's good in your hand. We got that. Uh, what else we got new? There's more new stuff. What's the part number on that? Part number on that is X, uh, SXLB12. Somebody will ask, and now they won't have to. No, they won't have to now. What else we got new? Well, I'm going to tell you, that green tray I got, I love that song we got. Yeah, I got those too. The other new thing we got is the Master Wire Tool Insertion Kit. So have y'all ever run any wires? Have you ever run any wires? Fortunately. Yeah, well this one right we here. We do it fancy now around here. We use a coat hanger and some tape. Now yeah. see, that's how I did it. But I want you to look at this thing. You take this, one of these, either one. You stick it through the garment. You run your wire in through the tool and then pull the tool out and the wire's through it. Now how cool is that? It's like one of them piercing tools. Uh -huh. I've yeah. them, they're a little bit small in there right there, but I do not have the angle one. Yeah, so. Michael come out or or got on board and got these so now you just run it through the tool there's no tape and because we all know if you put too much tape on the coat hanger guess what it don't go through yeah or it pulls off and your wire's just sitting there right that's usually what happens to me and then i cuss and i can go take a break yeah well now you ain't gotta worry about that no more right that's a nice setup wit two yeah, is the part number, number for you guys wish i'd had that when i was doing all them lift kits and lights and stuff like that I wish we'd have had that the other day when I was running one through the door of a Jeep Cherokee. Yep. Sure enough. Should have called Clay and said, hey, I got it in. I actually thought about That's it. That's it. That's what I was mm -hmm. talking about. They got a three wire set too. Yes, yeah, right here. That's the one I got. It's the three wire. But really, I don't ever use three. I always use the two. Don't do that. Don't do that. Didn't expect that. Hey, have you got those test lead sets? Which one? You know, like that one you got that's got the, what is it, 20, 30 pieces in it? Oh, yeah. Um, the ultimator. The best one to have is the, the big one. I'm that's what see. she always says, huh. Wally. Well, you are not be one. messing with me then. I'm going to have the big one. <coughs> I don't know if I have the one you're talking about. Here, I can show you. Give me a second. Yeah, go get it. Let's it's, see the um, it's scattered in there. You know, it's. Like this is the back probe set. They come in there. It's got the you know they're made with the leads on it, so you can click them on your multimeter. Yeah. And they'll fit in different applications. Well, let's see here. I have a 130 piece test lead kit, 96 piece lead kit. We got several different ones. I don't know which one. Something like that right there. You know, it's got them, his is in a, like a little metal box and it's got a clear glass top on it. Well, that's what it looks like right there. That may be it. Okay, there's some stuff. Part number is MD-146. MD-146. Look at there, we found it. That was it. Yeah, I was showing him. I got several different ones. You got that one. You got that one. I think that's the one right there. No, no, no. That's look here, man. How much is the uh, Repo 38? It's uh, 280, I think. That's what I got on that. The guy didn't have it long. He turned it back in. He couldn't couldn't find the funds at the time, which happens. But. Pretty nice. Okay. Uh, what you looking at, Wally? Back probe. They were handy. Lord, yes. Handy, handy. Now mine's about like yours scattered around in my box because mine come in a little cardboard box and then they come all apart. What you thinking, Bill? Mm, yeah, no, no. Ends on. You socking it today? Yeah, I reckon I'm gonna get me some great socks. I don't know I can have it today, man. 
All right, guys, it looks like everybody's buying the socks. You know what I'm saying? We all got a big pile. So, Molly's buying the back probe set and uh, some sunglasses. Like I said, uh, Oakley. Mm-hmm. Got to try them on for everybody. Let me see how bad they look at them, Molly. I've already had a set of these before. Don't let your wife use them. No. Try yes, Christina, don't use my Oakleys. Try them on it when I say it. You're going to get in trouble. Right she lost my other set. He says that on I camera, think. but when it comes down to it, well, he's like, was... yes, baby, you can wear my Oakleys. See. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. You look kind of like a, kind of like you would be like a race car driver or something. You know how all the race car drivers stand up beside the pits and look cool while everybody's <laughs> working and you watching them? You need a deeper accent. Hey, that's what goes on in the shop, ain't it? He just was missing the glasses. I see it. <laughs> Lord of mercy. All right, guys, we're going to turn this thing off. Y'all can see Wally looks sporty in his new Oakleys. We're all getting socks, and Wally's getting a back probe set. So. Like always, guys, thank you for watching. If you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up and click that subscribe button right down there. It's free. It don't cost you a dime. That way you get the newest, latest, greatest, most awesome stuff we got to show you. Y'all have a great one. Catch you next